a historically good year, said the French Environment Minister, as France presents a record low in emissions of planet-warming gases for 2023, even dropping below 2020, the year COVID-19 halted travel and slowed economic activity. And for the first time, the savings made were across the board, sector by sector. Emissions are measured in CO2e, CO2 equivalent, as it is in fact eight different gases produced by human activity that contribute to heating the Earth's atmosphere. Methane, for instance, mostly produced by livestock in France, is another problem area, as France has made only small gains. But France's nearly 5% overall cut between 2022 and 2023 puts the country on the right track for its short-term target, as the minister pointed out. In 2023, we moved at the pace we need to maintain until the end of the decade. As France aims to cut emissions to 270 million tonnes of CO2 equivalent by 2023, a stepping stone towards net zero in 2050. But critics point out that transport remains a problem area for France, with high emissions and only modest progress. And that if energy consumption has dropped, this may only be a temporary response to soaring prices.